I'm acoustic guitar senior editor Taya Gurken, and I'm here with a Composite Acoustics OX. You can probably tell right away that this is an unusual guitar, as it's made almost entirely out of carbon fiber materials. Indeed, the entire body, neck, and even some internal components are carbon fiber. There's not a bit of wood inside. Composite Acoustics, which is a company owned by PV, has applied a very creative approach to working with carbon fiber. For example, if you look at the area where the body meets the neck, it becomes apparent that this kind of shaping would be very difficult to do on a wooden guitar. Also, the neck is very thin all the way from the nut to the body, and there's easy access all the way to the highest frets. The guitar I have here has what Composite Acoustics calls its raw finish, which means that it has a sort of a matte or satin surface. A shiny glass finish in various colors is also available as an option. The OX has a body that's about orchestra size, and it's quite shallow, which makes it very comfortable to play. This guitar has a relatively narrow nut at slightly less than 1 and 11 16th inches, but current production models have a slightly wider 1 and 3 quarter inch nut. The guitar has a 25 and a half inch scale, uh, 2 and 1 quarter inch string spacing at the saddle, and black tuning machines with an 18 to 1 ratio. This guitar includes the optional LR Bags electronics package, and I'll come back to that in a moment. The guitar, as you see it here, has a list price of $1,949, and it sells for about $1,500. Since you've already heard me play a bit of fingerstyle on the guitar, uh, which was completely acoustic, by the way, I'm not plugged into the amp yet, uh, let's also hear acoustic guitar editor Scott Nygaard giving it a workout with a flat pick. <laughs> As I mentioned before, this OX includes LR Bags Electronics. Specifically, it's a Stage Pro element system, which combines LR Bags element under saddle transducer with a preamp mounted in the guitar side. There are controls for volume and tone, as well as a notch filter, face switch, and an onboard chromatic tuner. Let's have a listen to how this system sounds plugged into this AER Alpha amp. <laughs> So that's the Composite Acoustics OX. It's a very cool sounding and feeling guitar. And of course, it has the advantage of being much more resistant to damage from heat or humidity extremes than a typical wooden guitar. You can read a full review online at AcousticGuitar.com or in the print edition of Acoustic Guitar. For Acoustic Guitar, I'm Taya Gurken.